Welcome back to Fox 8 News in the morning. So local food pantries have been seeing an overwhelming demand since the COVID-19 pandemic began. And there is a new way that you can help feed those in need. Bonnie Plant is partnering with AmpleHarvest.org for the Grow More, Feed More program. CEO of Bonnie Plants, Mike Sutter, is here to explain how the program works all the way from Alabama this morning. Hi, Mike. How are you? I'm fantastic. Thank you. How are you doing? We're great. Uh, the shop behind you looks fantastic. So talk a little bit about Bonnie Plants and what you guys do and also this program. Yeah, sure. Um, so Bonnie Plants, we've been around since 1918 and our mission is really about helping gardeners across the country be able to grow fresh vegetables in their home gardens. Um, we have facilities, farms just like this one around the country um so you've always got a locally grown fresh plant at the store near you whether it's home depot lowe's walmart you can buy our plants pretty much anywhere and bonnie is really excited to be partnering with the nonprofit ampleharvest.org on this grow more feed more initiative which is really about encouraging home gardeners to donate surplus vegetable harvest to their local food pantries and it's really in the spirit of victory gardening, which started way back in World War I and World War II, where neighbors would grow extra vegetables to plant them for, to help feed other neighbors in their community. And we see that exact same opportunity now, as you mentioned, millions more people unemployed, pressure on local food pantries. So really all everyone has to do, anybody who's listening or watching right now, you know, if they just plant one of an extra vegetable plant like this little guy uh, in their home garden and then just donate that extra harvest that they get to their local food pantry, it can make a really big difference. It can. And Mike, talk about that because the process, uh, some might not know what to do. I mean, we all have ample amount of tomatoes and, and what right. have you. So do they need to be taking... Um, security measures, safety measures, you know, kind of when they're harvesting to make sure they're staying clean and all the products are staying clean. And what's the process maybe of donating it? Where do they go? Yeah, absolutely. So one of the great things about ampleharvest.org is it was COVID-19 friendly before COVID-19 was a thing. It really is all about a touchless donation straight from the home garden to a local food pantry. And so all anyone has to do is go to ampleharvest.org type in your zip code and you will see all the local food pantries in your area. And there are a ton of them in Cleveland and you connect directly with that local food pantry in a range of time where you can drop your vegetables off. You don't have to see anybody touch anything, et cetera. And then those vegetables will go straight to the people who need them most right now. So it's a really efficient way to get food from home gardens directly to the people that need it right now. Yeah, what a great idea. And I was kind of skimming through your website all morning long. You guys are very involved with different communities and even teaching kids how to garden. Yes. So there's a lot to find on the website and quickly touch on what else you guys offer as well because I noticed some recipes. So we have all this stuff, right, that we've grown, but what do we make? That's right. So you want to, you know, do something with your harvest. So we'd love to have you donate that extra harvest to Ample Harvest through ampleharvest.org to your local food pantry. But we have lots of great recipes on bonnieplants.com where you can find great things on what to do with those tomatoes, peppers, zucchini. And also just right now, um, we're donating 5% of all the sales on bonnieplants.com to ampleharvest.org so we can help that way as well. Again, looking to take that surplus harvest and get it to the people that need it most right what now. What a great idea. We appreciate what you guys are doing. Mike Sutter, CEO of Bonnie Plants, all the way in Alabama. Good to see you. Thank you. Good to see you. I appreciate it. We will have a link on our website. If you'd like to donate, just click Scene on TV.